So you might be trying to figure out how you can use math notes on iOS 18. So this is a very, very cool thing to do, and I love math notes a lot. It's a new feature within iOS 18. So to do this, what you're going to want to do is you want to go ahead and open up your calculator application. So what you can do is you can tap on the calculator right here, and then this page is going to come up. Now what you're going to want to do here is you want to go ahead and tap on calculator. So when you do that, this page is going to come up. It's going to be your standard calculator application. What you want to do here is you want to click on the bottom left little option, the little button that you have here. And what's going to happen is going to few, have a few things come up. Whether you're on your iPhone or iPad, it's probably going to be the same thing. And then you'll see this little math notes option. So you can go and tap onto math notes right here. And then your actual, it's going to look like a notes tab that comes up, but it's going to be your math notes. That's what they call it. So what you can do here is you can click on the bottom right corner, which should show you this like pencil icon drawing thing. You want to tap on it there, and this next page is going to come up. Now within this particular page, this is where you can actually start doing a few things. One, you can just basically, you know, write actual equations. You can do like two, like divided by two, and then it'll already start drawing things out for you like this. Or you can click on this pencil icon, which is right here, and you can start drawing things out here too. So I can do like two plus two equals, and it will start drawing out that actual answer for me. Now this one, it doesn't really know for a fact because it looks like it's like some other thing. So I don't even know what I did. But if I do like one plus one equals, then it'll give it a little bit of a better example. So as you can see it's two and it's going to copy my handwriting and put it there. So that's how it's done. You can click down in the top right corner whenever you're ready. You can also click back here and go back into your regular calculator. And that's basically how it works. It's a super basic process. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would be so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, Solon.